The giant's head was at least three times the size of a man's, but the features were definitely human, except for the staring eyes. The iris was the strange pale lilac color that now seemed consistent with all Nephilim. The chiseled mouth and nose, strong chin, coarse yellow hair. A shallow but definite pulse was beating under the pallid flesh. God have mercy, Alessandro stared up at Guba. It's alive. Of course it is alive. They are all alive. They have just been sleeping for thousands of years. The South Polar Underworld had released its grisly secret. The ancient race of flaxen-haired supermen that Ulrich Huber and the Nazis had combed Neuschwabenland for eight decades earlier. Hitler's Übermensch, sons of the fallen. The mythical hybrids of human and fallen angelic DNA actually existed. The Nephilim had been exhumed. Operation Pale Horse was underway. It was Resurrection Day.